Hey guys, my name is Alyssa. Welcome to my channel. If you're here from TikTok, <laughs> welcome. If you're here from Instagram, welcome. And if you're here because you just subscribed, I love you. So today what we're gonna go ahead and do, if you've seen the video, is a um, makeup look inspired from a movie that I've seen. If you've read the title, you know exactly what this is. So we'll go ahead and do it. So first things first, we're gonna have to make my eyebrows really thin. What I've learned from YouTube is that you glue down your eyebrows because I'm wearing no makeup right now. And these are my eyebrows. And I'm gonna have to make sure that these completely disappear so I look like that. That's scary. So I've just got some Elmer's stick glue, courtesy of my sister. And we're just gonna start gluing these down. And I think we're supposed to put like a layer of like translucent powder or something in between each one, so. Let's do it. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and turn it off and then come back when I have no eyebrows. Okay, so the eyebrows are taking longer than I thought, so we're just gonna go ahead and go in with the eyeshadow. Also, with all of the foundation that I've used on my eyebrows, I've been able to spread it all over my face, so foundation is done. <laughs> this is taking a while to dry, because you can still see my eyebrows through it. Beautiful. I'm going to use it from the Clinique palette. So this is my little Clinique palette, and we're gonna go ahead and use what color is that? Hazy. I don't think that's the right color, then. but they're all out of order. So I'm gonna call it Jammin, if that's the one. So we're gonna go with Jammin and then just do blue on our eyelids. And it's just like, that's it. It's just straight blue. Wow, you can see it from over there. We're gonna do two types of blue. So the blue that's on my eyes now and another blue which is more of a bright, vibrant. Yeah, you can see that. We're gonna do the bi bright, vibrant part on the eyelid, and then we'll do the, um, more of what I have on already on the upper part. I like it, it's good. Thank you, Grandma. It's cute. Thank you. I can remember my sister, both times. Huh? Uh, four, five of Tanya. Uh-huh. She painted my dad, she looked very beautiful, the eyes. Oh, she did the same eye color? I don't know, it was in, in the, I don't know. So she liked this color like that. Look at you. She paint very beautiful. I think that's gonna be it for the um, eye foundation, or for the eyebrow foundation. Um, <laughs> I do not have a, um, I don't have an eyebrow pencil. So we're gonna try to do this with shadow and make it dark. We're gonna do it with eyeliner actually and then like add in we're gonna see how this goes it feels weird looking at myself without any eyebrows um, I don't know if you've had this experience but <laughs> it's odd let's go ahead and take a eyeliner we're gonna use the beauty counter eyeliner and we're just gonna draw these arches for Doris's eye oh they're not arches they're more just like high you know they look like the Mona Lisa that's what I feel like right now <laughs> let's get where we're gonna have that outline at all right, I messed up, but it's okay. The amount of foundation that is getting on my, that is, um, is a lot. So if you know how to take your eyebrows off better than me, clearly it's not the best. Um, you know, and you wanna leave a comment below, I would appreciate. All right, so that's what we're gonna color in now. Okay, so this eyebrow is a lot thicker than this one, so this is what I'm gonna be showing on camera. Oh yeah, so we need a little lip dot. Oh, and it looks like her nostrils are a little bit higher up, which I'm not gonna lie, I have kind of big nostrils, but we're gonna make them even bigger. So this is just gonna be our experiment one. And we'll go ahead and add a little extra, extra nostrils to the inside here. So we're using black because when you look at a person's nose, it's just black, look. It looks bigger and wider already. Perfect, and repeat to the other side. Sorry if this keeps on moving around. Um, I'm trying to, at the same time, make the TikTok as I do this video, because this video is a tutorial, because I'm not gonna do this multiple times. All right, my nose looks uh, like the things are higher already. And then I was looking at the photo of Doris and the 
things here are very much, she has a skinnier nose, so we're gonna go ahead and try to contour that. I don't even have to use good makeup on this, which is great because, um, you know, this is the joke. All right. And we're just gonna blend that out with our fingers because, oh my gosh. <laughs> if you're wondering, I cannot. I, I might be able to if we just wipe. Okay, so we are able to make that a bit thinner. It's just not as high, so the eyebrows aren't even anymore. Okay. Okay, we're gonna try to go a bit higher. Oh, perfect. That looks like my regular eyebrow, but higher. So we got the nose, we're gonna have to do the eyes. We're gonna take this. Um, so she didn't go too, too heavy it looks like. So we're not gonna go too, too heavy. We're gonna do a little bit here and I'm very bad at under the eyes, so. You're talking to your highness. She does the lip liner. And oh, oh, there's my lipstick. So she has lip liner and a braid in her hair, like a little headband braid. So we'll do that. First things first, lip liner. I got the automatic lip liner raspberry from Ulta, Ulta brand. So this one is a no brand, no number on it or anything, um, but it's kind of dark. So, you put the two together. Okay, so I thought the lip liner was gonna stick out a little bit more, but that's fine. Now we've got the makeup part done. Luckily, Doris and I both have short hair, and that's why it's easy for her to put it up in a um, headband, like a bird's nest uh, braid. So that's exactly what I'm about to do. Let's do this, Doris. Let's get this, girl. Um, this one's not gonna wrap completely around. We're just gonna do that. I don't know if you can see it. And we're gonna leave it. Last thing is to take off our necklace. And then she has an open kind of square neckline. Um, I don't, so I'm just going to try to tuck it into my bra like that for a square-ish mock neckline. And um, there we go. Oh, her sleeves are down, not up. Okay, I thought they were up. All right, shirt, earrings, hair. It's all done. Also, it's raining outside. Um, this looks better from afar because my eyebrows are still kind of visible because they're so Now we're gonna go ahead and see what my sister thinks. One, two, three. I'm Doris from Shrek. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> That's so gross, why would you ever do that? Oh, Grandma wants to see too. Ooh, this one is big. Uh-huh. And here, can I see? Yeah. I like it, this color in here. Why you be making big in here? Um, I, I did it because the eyebrow look was different than my eyebrows. Oh, well, I like it, the color you use it, it looks nice than you. Ah, thank you. Mm -hmm. I like it. That's it for my makeup look. I hope you liked it. Um, if you want to see more of these, subscribe. Um, <laughs> and let me know what characters or whatever, I guess, to do, and I'll do it the best of my ability. I'll see y'all later, guys. Bye.